good morning students in this class we are discussing about the four different topologies of the feedback amplifiers so what are the different categories of feedback amplifiers those are voltage series feedback amplifiers voltage shunt feedback amplifiers current series feedback amplifiers and current shunt feedback amplifier first we will learn the block diagrams of the four different topologies first draw the basic feedback amplifier here it consisting of basic negative feedback amplifier amplifier and here it is the feedback network in the output section we have sampling input section mixer with the source so this is the basic feedback amplifier here the first one is the voltage series feedback amplifier so generally mixing has two types series and shunt so voltage series means the series is at the input port so first draw the amplifier basic amplifier and feedback network so it is series mixing okay sampling again two types we have voltage sampling and current sampling so voltage means it is at the output port this is the load resistance rl and this is voltage sampling shunt lo connect cheyalani ikkada voltage means shunt connection so this is the vs voltage source vi and this is v not a part of the output is given to the feedback network v not and it is vf so here beta is equal to what is beta the feedback factor beta is equal to vf by v not okay here a is equal to v not by vi v not by vi so this is the voltage series feedback amplifier what is the second one voltage shunt okay first draw the basic amplifier then draw the feedback network again voltage means sampling voltage sampling output side here shunt is shunt mixing input side so draw the shunt connection so draw the shunt connection when the mixing is shunt mixing here the input source is is okay so mixing is shunt mixing means the input source is current source so ikkada voltage mixing kabatti voltage source so here shunt mixing kabatti current source raayalani is so then voltage sampling the output is v not and here the input to the feedback network is v not and the mixing is shunt mixing the source is current so here the feedback is if okay so here i i is i i because of this 
shunt mixing so here the feedback factor beta is equal to if by v not and ai a is equal to v not by i i so this is for voltage shunt and the third one is the current series okay so this is first draw the basic amplifier again feedback network first series mixing series means mixer at the input port so series mixing and here the sampling is current sampling not voltage sampling so current sampling means we have to draw like this current sampling this is rl so this is current series so series mixing means the voltage source is voltage is in series so ala gurt pettukondi so vs voltage source is vs and here in vi so but the output should be i not current sampling output should be i not and here i not here output is vf feedback factor so beta is equal to vf by i not beta is equal to vf by i not and a is equal to i not by vi a is equal to i not by vi and the last one is the current shunt basic amplifier feedback network so shunt shunt mixing have to draw the shunt at the input side shunt mixing current sampling so here current sampling so shunt mixing kabatti shunt lo gisamandi current series kabatti output ila series lo giyal rl so here current shunt shunt mixing means we have to given the source is the current signal so here also shunt the source signal is the current signal so shunt same source signal is the current signal is so here i i current series me current sampling so current sampling means the output is i not so here i not if i i means if so here beta is equal to i if by beta is equal to if by i not okay so these are the four different topologies of the feedback amplifiers four different topologies of feedback amplifiers so by defining series mixing and shunt mixing by defining sampling voltage sampling and current sampling we can identify the input impedance and output impedance suppose here if the series mixing if the topology in this topology the mixing is a series mixing the input resistance is increasing so automatically the output resistance decreased okay so coming to the sampling it is voltage sampling if it is voltage sampling the output resistance is decreasing and the 
if it is current sampling if it is current sampling the output resistance is increasing okay once again i am repeating in series mixing the input resistance is increasing if it is shunt the output resistance is decreasing in voltage sampling the output resistance is decreasing and the current for current sampling the output resistance is 